Hello and welcome to 12 Volt Planet TV. My name is Craig and today we will show you the various ways to hook up your LED lights. Let's first show you how to hook up just one single LED light. You have your power going to the fuse to protect the circuit and that goes into the positive feed of your light. Next you have your negative cable which will go back to your power source to complete the circuit. If you wanted to switch the light on and off, simply add an on off switch between the fuse and the light as shown. So how do we hook up LED lights? Well the first thing to note is that our LED lights must be connected in parallel. When lights are connected together positive to negative to positive to negative this is called in series and can be used for lights with incandescent bulbs. LED lights are sadly polarity sensitive and must be connected up in parallel, which is positive to positive to positive and negative to negative to negative. Series and parallel connections are both used to turn all lights on at the same time. It's just that series won't work with LED lights sadly, so they must be connected in parallel. Here you can see we have connected our lights up in series. So you have a positive to positive, then the negative from the first light going to the positive of the second light then down to the negative and the lights are not working. When we take off the positive that's connected to the first light's negative and attach it to a negative thus completing the circuit, the light then turns back on. This is because the light is now hooked up in parallel. The easiest way of adding more lights to a circuit is with piggyback terminals. These terminals can be used to splice in multiple lights to your positive cable as shown in our diagram. As you can see with our example, this means you'll only have one cable coming from your battery, sharing power to all your lights. This saves on having multiple lights all connected to the battery at the same time. Should you wish to again be able to switch all the lights on and off at the same time, simply install an on off switch after the fuse and before your first light along the main feed cable, as shown in our diagram. You can also use a buzz bar to hook up the lights in parallel. Once your lights are connected to the buzz bar, you can connect a cable from your battery to the buzz bar and it will power all your lights as shown in our example. The question we get asked a lot is how do I connect two switches to my lights to activate them from either switch? In this section we will show you how. First you'll require two on on switches. Here you can see in the diagram how you would install this setup. Firstly your power from your power source to the fuse and then to your first switch. Next, another length of cable to the lower terminal on switch 1, which then goes to switch 2. Next, another length of cable from the upper terminal on switch 1 to the upper terminal on switch 2. Finally, your cable from the center terminal to switch to on your lights.
When the circuit is activated, power will come through the sensor terminals and leave switch 1 through either of the terminals connected, depending on the position the switch is in. When switch 2 is flicked, it will either make or break the connection to switch number 1 and feed the power through to the sensor terminal or will just close the circuit, switching the lights off, as shown in our example here. Thank you very much for watching. To see our full range of LED lights, please visit our shop here. If you like this video, please give us a like and subscribe for future videos. Thank you very much and enjoy the rest of your day.